Sight and Aspect is awesome, they say. Cool. I gotta try that out at some point. Well, let's be Captain Hades, yeah. Same setup here? Sure. Do your worst, father. Oh, and we start with a, uh... Oh, we can give Ambrosia to Dio. Hello. What does one offer to the god of wine? The very best is what. And down here, this is it, mate. I'm grateful I've got some of your spirit in me. To have such a connection with you despite all the distance between us. Zag, I cannot believe what you're offering to me. Ambrosia man for me? And talk about a bottle that has seen some wild days and nights. I mean, if it got all the way to you down there, only to come back up. Know what? I'm saving it till we can share it here. The key to any halfway decent feast is lots and lots of preparation, man. Or maybe just happen to improvise, you know? I know. Okay, we got Drunken Flourish. Hangover on the special is pretty tempting here. Let's do it. Let's see if we can uh, we can force a crazy hangover build with this poison shield now. Not yet. You're in my way. And a second boon from Dio or 200 gold. I'm just gonna take more boons, quite frankly. Denizens of the deep, arise. I think I got one. Wow, a skin of Scion. Uh, yeah, let's just take another boon. Out of my way. Over there. Olympus, I accept this message. Reroll these. Any other boons for me? Okay, we can get trippy shot or peer pressure. Uh, trippy shot opens up some duos that we might not actually want. Now nah, we'll take trippy shot. Go for a crazy build here. A lot of the interesting duos um, require that for Dio. Devastated. Love you too, Spinny Doom Shield. Ooh, Chaos Gate early on. the chaos game going in worked out last time surely it'll do so again Ooh, plus one cast from maimed grasp just have to avoid attacking for three encounters, and we'll get uh, one more Bloodstone, which is huge with the Trippy Shot already. More bonus special or attack damage, not a lot of it. Give me that Maimed Grasp, please. And... Let's take the Max Elf over a visit to uh, Sisyphus here. So, no attacking during this encounter if I want to avoid taking too much damage. Chaos. Panic 
little bit there. But I've got healing available to me. The event that I should need it. Duo between Zeus and oh, it's the festive fog lightning thing. Ooh, ooh, I'm down for that. Shield follows you around if you recall it. Yes, so I can force it to. Uh... Blast a tombstone then. I can force it to if I want to. Lord Zeus! Please, Lord Uncle Zeus, accept this gift of nectar in your honor, though it is such a pittance in comparison to all the generosity you've shown. I'm very pleased to see a show of such respect and admiration for your uncle, Sagrius. You'll go quite far here on Olympus with an attitude like that. Not everyone's as mannered, nor as wise. Give me your call. What I would like from Zeus here. The Lady Demeter still prattles on about her missing girl, Zagreus. But I want you to understand something, all right? She's gone. We all have grieved. This is my mother he's talking about. Demeter shall finally accept what has occurred, and we can move forward, having grown stronger as a family. Lightning Strike, Thunder Dash, Lightning Reflexes. I guess we'll just take the Lightning Strike for the, uh, Boon Rex. Not gonna spend my last reroll there. I will take a pomegranate in the form of nectar, though, leveling up one of our boons, or take another reroll. Actually, quite significant to get the reroll here. Chance for the duo boon? I have no idea. No chance uh, because we have no none of the prereqs yet. But uh, now that we have them, we have a chance to see it whenever we take a boon from either of them. Yes, yeah, so you can get the shield to follow you around if you recall it here. You can drag it through enemies like this. Kind of effective. No Sisyphus. Gangway. Thank the gods. That's better. Who doesn't have this stuff? Hey, and we level up our trippy shot. That's lucky. Take what's mine. Stop him, Riches, now! Worthless, Riches. Well, that's better. The boons? Daedalus Hammer or Poseidon Boon. Tough choice here. It's gonna be the hammer. Although I don't particularly like the hammer. Um, with the uh, the Zeus shield. I'll take it. Our special deals damage to foes around us when we cast it. Our dash strength deals more damage in a larger area. And Minotaur Rush. Here's the explosive return. Let's take it. I should do it. So that's a... Oh, oh, I see why that's ridiculous, right? You too, Charon, you too. I have to see how much damage that does. You can have two hammers, and you can get a third in um, sticks. Wait, does that do poison? Oh! The explosion benefits from my uh, special boon, I had no idea. Oh, that's crazy good. Jeez. That is ridiculous. We get Artemis again, crit. Yes. That's 
huge too. Some of Charon's ways. Hell yeah, give me a chaos gate. Chaos gates are good. Upgrade the trippy shot more, or I that first upgrade on your uh, hangover is huge. 25% more, actually 33% more, excuse me, poison damage is enormous here. Happily gonna take a chaos gate rather than another pomegranate. our money for three encounters to gain a much higher chance of rarer boons. Otherwise, more gems in darkness or more dash strike damage? Nah, we'll take Popper's favor. We just want to avoid anything money related. Don't have enough cash for a shop to be good, so we'll take a boon from Hermes. Yes! Yes! The boon uh, chamber counter there up in the top, uh, top right. Pretty useful. That you finally got out of there, cuz. Big congratulations, dude, for that. Congrats. The secret's safe with me, of course. The others here, they think you're still at it. Though, I guess you are. Two more dashes, always good. Don't mind 30% more move speed either, but I love Greatest Reflex. That's more dashes. Stuff. Ultimate defensive boon. Dodging. Alright, who's gonna get obliterated? Hope I didn't keep you waiting, ladies. <laughs> Electo. Oh, it's the god of trash. Come once again to filthy up this place. You're getting real predictable, you know. Considering I beat you last we met, I'd be much more concerned with your predictability than mine. Don't wanna hear it from you, trash! Just wanna see you bleed. <laughs> now you come here. Two. I get hit by that. Ha ha ha! Because you first over time too, personally, I try not to deal with it at all. <laughs> it's it's tough. It's definitely tough. Extreme measures two. Don't play with extreme measures three. I respect I that. See you come in. Next stop, Asphodel. Well, I did. Maybe I should switch. Switch to the spike collar for some more max health. For now, makes this uh, fountain heal a bit bigger. Mediocrity. 
Eocrity. Up we go. Clear. By the way, forgotten, uh, forgotten Kane here in chat, by the way, Lancet has cleared Heat 57, which I believe is the highest recorded heat kill, heat clear. So if you're looking for uh, an expert on high heat runs, you're talking to them. All right, let's catch some fish. Meanwhile, I've done all of 132 heat run, mostly do 20 heat, really enjoy it. Now, go to crustacean. I could see myself going back up to 32 when I unlock Extreme Measures 4. But uh, until that happens. Hey, Confusatron. Glad to f that you found your way back to the stream. Or a palm, I'll take the Zeus. We already have the Prurex for um for the duo here. Which would make our festive fog like sick nasty good. Dodging my shots! Scintillating Feast. Our festive fog effects also deal lightning damage periodically. We have two festive fog casts, and that festive fog is level two already. So these are gonna be potent. Potent. And now we can sell our attack boon if we want to, that's true. or swap it out. I'm gonna take a uh, shop here, because I don't really care for a darkness room. Potent potable, if you will. But what if I won't? Sure. Sure, we'll bring, uh, bring Aphrodite into the mix here. I guess I'll take Passion Dash. Our dash deals damage where we end up, inflicting weaken. I'm really thrilled with that, but I'm uh, kind of fine. Hello, Mega Gorgon. <laughs> Hello there, Dionysus. Olympus, I accept this. Savage. Message. That's an early enough strong drink, I wouldn't mind it. Or high tolerance, 19% less damage taken while in festive fog. 
can be pretty good. Or positive outlook for less damage taken at 40% or below health. Let's take another strong drink. This will be 15% uh, damage by the end of the run. Kind of liked it last run. Let's take it again. And it's Eurydice time. We'll definitely take the uh, level ups. We'd like to level up our... Everything that we have, pretty much. Hey, they're singing again. They're both here. Hi. Hey, you two. How's everything lately? On speaking terms again? Or singing terms? Oh, things are going very wonderfully, my friend. I never thought I'd see Eurydice again. After I... Orpy still just can't shut up about that time, <laughs> but we're making progress. Thanks for having him stop by. I'm sure he needed plenty of encouragement. Don't we all? Yeah, give me that palm porridge. Four. Plus one level ups. Trippy shot, drunken flourish, lightning strike, and passion dash. No complaints there. We're at nine hangover damage and 222 festive fog damage. To two fountains per chapter. Wouldn't that be nice? shop or max health? I guess I'll take some max. No, I'll take the money. Try to perfect this. I'm in. So we have to take no damage at all in this encounter to get the reward. Luck to me. Let's see you put your youthful reflexes to work. Got four dashes, so I think it'll be alright. Festive Fog basically do all the work. Easy. Happiness riches. No problem. Demeter. Demeter Boon yet? Oh, we could get the, um... The other thing with Festive Fog, right? It's her duo. Ice Wine. Festive Fog also inflicts chill. If we take Frost Strike, Flourish Dash, or her aid. Probably her aid. Could get a rare crop too, that would be fine. The bitterness of cold and death go hand in hand, I do suppose. Up out our dash, ravenous will or snowburst. So if we want a chance at uh at the thingy, we'd swap out our dash here. I don't really care for Aphrodite. Yeah, let's uh let's swap it out. Aphrodite won't mind. Just for the chance of uh, ice wine here. Hey, Lerny. Why must we always fight you're like super vulnerable learning? to my build, so you're gonna die real fast.
Olympus, Prince Sand. Hmm. Oh, this is chaotic. Kinda dig it though. Unaware of his uh, ability here. You get a full heal anyway. Back to wherever your neck went. Right. The screen can definitely get a little cluttered with visual effects, especially if there's a lot of enemy attacks or uh, boons going on. It's. It's a lot easier uh, if you're the one playing, though, to make sense of it. I find. Okay, we still have the max health trinket equipped? That's crazy pants. Keep that equipped. Power. Someone forgot to buy max health. Six encounters of more cast damage for 20 gold? You know what? I'll take that. The Braid of Atlas. We can sell our, uh... Should I take the trade? Not these. Could have sold our, uh, attack. At the pool, purging there. Here. Yes. Feels like I should be getting hit more than I am. The dash is the the key here. Every time we uh, every time we dash, we get a brief, you know, a brief moment of being invulnerable. So, and we can do it a lot thanks to the uh, Hermes boon we have. So that'll that'll avoid a lot of incoming hits. Take more max health. 195 is very little. Special, that special is an aspect ability, yeah, that's the aspect of Zeus special ability for the shield. You throw the shield like a discus and it periodically pulses with damage, doing the big nonsense to everybody nearby. It needs some titan blood to be good, but if you, uh, if you upgrade it, it's so strong. play with uh, the bonus trap damage, that right there. <laughs> Never again. Also, don't stand next to these guys, because their projectiles hurt a lot if you get hit point blank. Mistakes in my life. Shop with 668. Don't mind if I do. We could get more boons at the shop. Ooh. And it's membership card time. Let's do it. Don't spend it all. Hey, we got ice wine. Yes! Ice wine. Double cast ice wine with uh Oh man. Oh that's so strong. So this now instantaneously deploys and inflicts chill and still zaps for lightning damage periodically. Alright. Charon. Hey, free money. 
Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> Whoops. You and me care on, mate. That does so much damage. That was an enormous amount of damage output. I look forward to making use of this. We get the membership card giving us 20% discount. It's the butterfly ball. And the stupid butterfly ball is super dead. Hopefully. That's so much damage. Look at that. Not a gun hit. Yeah, that's that's a reasonable thing. Yes, agreed. In the name Big agree. Of the <laughs> I'll take Demeter's aid, giving us a uh, god gauge, charging up to do even more chill, and our second Daedalus hammer of the run. I will take as well. Good lord, these casts are strong. After blocking a foe, gain 20% damage and move speed for 10 seconds. Ferocious Guard seems pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, we did Forgotten Kane. It is gonna be ridiculous. More damage to armor, whatever, dash strike, I'm not really doing that. Let's take Ferocious Guard, I'll try to remember to block stuff to activate that. And a Demeter Boon if I can handle a Elysium... Infernal Gate. Let's try it. Well, here goes nothing. Let's try it. Post release, I think we're on five wins now. Something like that. I doubt you'll outmaneuver all this lot. Oh boy. Whoa, da, 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 da. Go in a circle. Let's go in a circle. That's the secret to Erebus. In the name of Hades. Hey, and a Nourish Soul for better healing. I, I tend to like Nourish Soul a lot. 
Uh, Snowburst is also cool because it makes our casting even better. Or Ravenous Will, also good because we're spamming casts. So actually any of these are totally fine. Let's take the Snowburst. So now we double explode. I like double exploding. This is the correct amount of exploding to do. Oh, we need Net Ravenous for the, uh, what is the Demeter Legendary anyway? I've actually completely forgotten. Oh, this is such a crazy build. Oh my god. Ready, Aegis. Oh, that's right, the, um, everything dies to chill. I love that boon. I've had that a couple times. So much exploding. Love all that. We can sell the trippy shot. Would that just turn off all of my... <laughs> we just ruined my build. Bad Dad Simulator. How's it going, Sneaky Teak? Bad Dad Simulator is going ridiculous. Is what it's going. What a steal. What a savings. All right, so we will take Ravenous Will to get the uh, chance at the Legendary, I guess. We have no cast. Take 10% less damage, deal 20% more. And I can't wait to see how this fares against the Heroes of Elysium. Don't have Killing Freeze. Not on this build yet, unfortunately. Kind of got a lot of Demeter Boons, though. The gods are testing us once more, Asterius. For how else to explain this fiend approaching us, bearing such blessings as would normally be fit only for heroes such as we? You do know I'm related to them, right? The god of the dead is my father. I'm sure word's gotten around. Not that I want deferential treatment from the likes of you. <laughs> Good, for you'll get nothing of the sort. The gods are on my side, not yours, monster. What business would they have abetting you? So if you uh, if you've got the right movement speed, you can actually get the shield to like perfectly line up with uh, Theseus. How now, demon? How now, brown cow? Jump. Oh. Demeter, beware of winter's cold. That you too had a chariot, so I could conquer you in racing, just as in battle. Oh, 
finally. Kerblam. With plenty of health to spare. Take the full heal, please. Thank you. Hey, here's our chance to sell Lightning Strike. Um... We already have Scintillating Feast. Yeah, let's just sell Lightning Strike now. Cool. Feel cleaner already. Some extra cash. And we'll Yarn of Ariadne. Take the Prometheus Stone, too. Should help keep me going. For a bonus cast for a little while. Cut keep the easy. Max Health Trinket equipped. There. For now. For now being the rest of the run, of course. I'm sure the satyrs are back. Here we are. Two boons from Demeter, one from Hermes, an 800 gold diamond that we could just outright buy. I will contemplate. So many boons from Demeter, wow. I think we're just basically guaranteed to get her legendary here. Why not? Well, let's just verify what we're gonna need for that. Harvest two of the following, Arctic Blast and Killing Freeze. There's Arctic Blast. Applying 10 stacks of chill causes a blast, clearing the effect. And doing 100 damage, we'll take that. Hello. What is happening? Unnecessary. There it is, Winter Harvest. Chill affected foes shatter at 10% of their health, inflicting chill nearby. And it even works on bosses. Pretty cool. Uh, exit is here. Which tunnel? Up, Zeus. Wouldn't mind a call related boon. He's got a bunch that would be really relevant. I can't. Still is nuts.
Any way to increase that? I don't think so. It's a lot. It's a lot on bosses. And there it is, Billowing Call. 24% bonus damage after using our call for 15 seconds. Is very, very, very good. Faster God Gauge charge is nice, but it's a low rarity boon. We'll take the epic rarity one. I've got two rerolls that I could slash should, question mark. A quiet taste. Be using. Now for a chat with Silvers. I think I am gonna buy the uh the diamond here. Ridiculous. <laughs> that is ridiculous damage. First act, that's right. Yeah, the so the regenerating cast, if you get multiple of them, is uh is really, really, really good. Is normally such trouble for me. I bet Charon's going to want all this. That was, quite frankly, too easy. So what's causing this ridiculous damage exactly? So most of it comes from our cast, and there's a lot of things happening on the cast here. Our cast is a level three trippy shot with rare rarity, so it's got a base of 222 damage. And then we have two duo boons affecting it. Scintillating Feast, Makes it do uh, 60 damage periodically. And Ice Wine causes it to be an instantaneous blast that also inflicts chill. Um, that chill causes an additional blast when we get 10 stacks of it. Um, we have plus one to our cast from a Chaos Boon, so we get two of these. And then there's like poison stuff happening, but it, it's mostly just all these boons um, modifying the cast to be ridiculously strong. Uh, should come in useful. Oh, and a faster special will make the uh, will make our shield pulse quicker. I should have used a reroll there, actually. But twenty percent faster special makes the shield pulse twenty percent faster, as I understand it. So that's pretty sweet. I'm gonna keep using the build because this is super fun. But you can see when we initially cast, it's 411 damage. And the lightning bolts are 93. there. Good enough to 
feet. Ooh, plus two on bellowing strength is cool. Thirty-eight percent. Or we can we can reroll and try to hit our cast. Just take the bellowing strength up. And we'll go. Might as well take everything here. heat that I've completed? 32. I have uh, all three statues from Skelly here. But 32 is my best. points. No. Alright, I'm gonna take the I'm gonna take the Demeter Boon, try to get killing freeze here. I'll take it. Nice. While all foes are chill affected, they are 15% slower and take 30 damage every 0.8 seconds. Cool, cool. A very good damage per second uh, boon. We have a ton of good Demeter Boons here. We really got mostly Demeter on this one. <laughs> Cerberus again accepts the sack. Thanks, boy. But you can set the level yourself, that's right, uh, Sibius. Basically, uh, a series of custom penalties like bonus extra enemy damage, bonus trap damage, just keep coming bonus back. enemy health, more enemies. But you can pick and choose and, and pick to any combination that you want. Aiding you. you must be so grateful to them for their aid, without which none of this would have been possible. Yeah, about that. Father, did, did you let Mother go because you feared Olympus would find out and not respond well to the circumstances if they did? <laughs> be grateful they have not found out as yet for all your meddling. You do not know them as well as you think. Ask yourself why she left Olympus, and how. Or better yet, ask her. Well, she seems quite lovely, so knowing you, you probably tricked her into signing a pact to come join you or something. Since you weren't allowed on Olympus, why not have Olympus come to you? Yeah, you probably, like, tricked her into eating some food she wasn't supposed to eat. Ha! <laughs> Surprisingly not distant from the truth. I took her, boy. I took her down with me. Is that what you wish to hear? Does that anger you? Come, bring forth that anger then. Darkness. Darkness? What? I totally dodged that. Nonsense. Got you. 
so much damage. We are not finished. No more. Take such disrespect from you. Ow. I jumped out a little earlier than I I thought he was gonna finish there. <laughs> Whoops. Whatever, just kill him. What you sow. And that would have been the, the special kill animation for 10% health. You cannot GG. None of us can. GG. My strength. Fails. Yes. By my father's name. We survived death using one of our death defiance charges uh, there. Those, uh, if you see these three little, up in, in the bottom left over our health bar, those three little Zagreus icons. Uh, when, you, uh, when you would die, you instead heal to half health and use up one of those charges. Unlocked through the Mirror of Darkness. One of the big ways that the game uh, game is forgiving, uh, allowing you to have second chances and kind of create tanky builds. My weapon shuddered at the touch of it. GG. The damage is real. Like it just it just peaks up a little bit, doesn't keep going. <laughs> it is gorgeous though. Gorgeous. Go back down. Only I could be so grossly incandescent. Where are my boons from Helios, huh? Here. Welcome back, my son. Hello, ah. mother. Hello. I could not stand it on Olympus, Sagrius. The blustering, the posturing, my overbearing mother. Hmm. None Real. of it. I would have left the mountain voluntarily, except. Except Father absconded with you, didn't he? Dragged you down with him into the underworld. So if Olympus were to find that out, I shudder to think of the consequences. That fool is trying to protect me even now. And himself. It wasn't he who absconded with me, my son. And it's more complicated even than that. I was content to leave. Willing to make my life within the underworld. With your father. I dare not ask who did bring you to father then. So essentially you ran away from home to live with him. I mean no disrespect, but... Did you realize what you were getting yourself into? <laughs> we have a tendency to be impetuous when we are younger, Zagreus. I heard all about your father before we met. Admired paintings of him. It was very awkward at first. But he had a bluntness, I fancied. A sense of principle. I much preferred him to his brothers, I can tell you that. So, uh, then you secretly left Mount Olympus to be with the God of the Dead in the Underworld. And Olympus never found out. What do you suppose would happen if they did? I think there would be war between Olympus and your father, Zagreus, if they found out. Especially now, after all this. And after all this time, they slew their parents once. If the Titans could be wiped from this world, so can we all. So it makes sense. If father, he agrees with you and thinks that leaving you in hiding here, that it's the only way he can prevent that war. Makes sense. I can see how your father, shrewd but also single-minded as he was, 
might have followed such a line of reasoning as that. Oh, Zagreus. What have I done? Come on. No. What have I done? Oops. Uh, I can't. Oh, I need to fix this. All right, sounds like my next step is to go punch Zeus, right? Ah, I, um, hello? Natural causes? Hey, wow, you did it! According to my list here, it says you've died, what, 50 times at least? That's more than anybody signed around here, I think. I'm sure you can catch up. So what happened there, Mezzo Emerus, is that uh, oh, because we're our father's you, son, boy. we are bound to the underworld and to leave it to go to the surface, even for a brief period of time. Mm -hmm. It beckons us to return. Will eventually, well, quite quickly, perish, die on the surface, removed from the realm of our father. The fallen warrior in Elysium we spoke of. He seems like a good man, though. Was he always the despondent sort? No, lad. I was that sort, I think. But he was not. He was one of the only men I knew who did not look upon me as a threat. He saw something in me I never knew was there, and in turn, with him. I felt, how to describe it, calm, whole. Huh, I'm restless all the time. I can only imagine. He had this wry humor about him, like he was wise beyond his years. A quality I trust shall see him through his struggles now. Although, I hoped residing in Elysium would mean he wouldn't have to struggle any longer. Hmm. Restlessness runs in my family, I think. I know uh, my father certainly suffers from restless dead syndrome. He shouldn't, sir. And neither should you. What are you doing here? I heard you finally made it out. What, did you break out of here only to die in some pathetic way on the surface? I died so many different ways on the surface. Just so many. Long story, but yeah. Boils down to what you said, more or less. So you're going back out there again. Well, it's your business, not mine. For your sake, I hope it's worth it. It is. Yeah, 500 darkness, I'll take it. That 500 darkness is uh, generally worth it. You need so much darkness. Do what you will with these, my good chef. All right, then. Ooh, 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 what's this? At last, the bridge to chaos is restored. Thank you so very much, my child. I shall be going then, and I shall presently return. Please, have no fear. And now, farewell. I shall bring Chaos your kindest regards. Good luck. Please do. Until next time, Nyx. <gasps> Nothing gets dirty around here while I am on the job, your highness. Bye, Dusa. Bye. This nectar not fancy enough for you boys, that it? You've developed quite the delicate palate at your distinguished age. <laughs> Though having little appetite remaining for the lightness of nectar's flavor, the multi-headed monster of the underworld nevertheless accepts. Delicious. Sounds like we're going to need to give him some ambrosia. You ever think of giving Thanatos a break, father? He seems to have more than his fair share of work of late. This is like a, some random dialogue, not related to the uh, direct plot. Okay. Blame the blasted mortals for perishing so easily, or blame Lord Ares prior to accusing me. With their surface wars, not only do they kill each other readily, but also often subsequently perish from the consequences of it all. What wars? What's going on up there? Why don't the other Olympians do something? Bah, how should I know? The mortals are equipped to settle their petty differences by any number of means. We have to make a room for them all, sooner or later, regardless. That's certainly a way of looking at it. Well, sooner or later, everybody ends up down here. It's real. Still no offering for Extreme Measures 4 here. Respect we'll need to keep, uh, keep unlocking surface dialogues for that. But that is going to bring us to the end of tonight's stream, as we're uh, hitting the 8-hour mark here. 
I guess this came to pass. The way to reunite Nixon chaos. We're almost done with that. Quick relay. Bad news. The only legendary boon we haven't got. Concentrated volley. Still need skeletal lure, flame wheel release, and touch of sticks. And we still have to learn to play the lyre, of course. We'll get there. We'll get there. So, uh, pal, my sources tell me that you made it pretty far, which means my usefulness is coming to an end. That's right, you won't have anybody to kill you. Your usefulness? What, you just mean the standing around letting me lay into you with whatever vicious attack sequence I fancy at the time? Yeah, once you achieve your goal, my contract's up. You won't need me anymore. But only if I leave for good, isn't that right? So if I stuck around, you'd stay here too? Probably, but wait, you're really gonna stay? Sure looks that way. Huzzah! Huzzah! Great success. Alrighty, that is gonna be it for me tonight, folks. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. Been a blast, both in Spire and in Hades tonight. We're gonna be live tomorrow, not later than noon Eastern Standard Time. Hope to see many of you there. And if not, well, thanks so much for watching. Alright everybody, ta-ta for now, see y'all next time, toodaloo, etc. Bye-bye now.